To turn a decimal into a percent, we begin with some common decimals that we all know. 0.5 we all know is 50%. Point two five we all know is 25%. And we all know that one whole is 100%. So the question would be, oh, what would be 3.375? Well, let's take a look at some patterns. Where's the decimal here in 50? It's right here. Where's the decimal in 25? It's right here. Where's the decimal in 100? It's right here. Here, we, the decimal in 1 is down here at the end of the 1. So what happened in the decimal going from 0.5 to 50? It moved over two places. Boom, boom, two places. What happened in 0.25? It moved over two places. What happened in the 1? It moved over two places, needing two extra zeros. So 0.375, according to the pattern, would be 37.5%.